Hello you guys, this is the boy Haas and first of all I just want to say it's been a while since I uploaded a video. I apologize about that. I promise y'all it's been busy doing some stuff in life and all that. I promise y'all I'll get back to it. I know I promised y'all like shitload of times already. I promise I promise y'all now I'll get back to it and upload consistently weekly every, as in like every week I'll upload a video. Now, first of all, I just want to say thank you for nearly 1600 subscribers. And I haven't even made a 1500 special video. Um, I appreciate it. And with that being said, um, today's video is something that's been going around the community a lot. And I've been seeing it. Uh, people have been talking about it. Videos being made about it. But I want to just talk about it a little bit. It's a glitch. This FIFA Skiller123 is a channel that do not promote glitches. But this uh, glitch is very fun. It makes the game hilarious. As in like you can create uh different positions uh midfield position wise now this glitch has not been discovered by me it was discovered by uh the main pro clubs youtuber his name is world of jcc i'll leave a link in description to his channel make sure you guys check him out show him some love you guys do what you gotta do now uh let's go straight to the leaderboard just to prove to y'all that this glitch is not you know on the game like it's not supposed to be on the game but you guys can try it because it's fun now if you guys can see in the top 100 you don't see an RDM or an LDM or a CM or, you know, a RAM. You don't see all that. You just see cam, right wing back, right mid, and all that. Now, you guys can, you possibly know about this glitch, but if you don't know about it, make sure you do it. It's very fun. You guys will enjoy it. Now, that being said, let's uh, click on player's growth. Again, this glitch has not been discovered by me. It was discovered by uh, World of JCC. I'll leave a link to his channel description. Make sure you guys check him out. Subscribe to him. Show him some love. Now, let's get straight into it. Now, first of all, I just want to elaborate on a few things. There's new gl uh, new uh, videos coming, new builds, as a 90 rated max overall. First, the CM build uh, next week, I'm going to upload it. So make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned. Turn on a notification. You know, because next week I will have a hard ass video for you guys uploaded. You guys will love it. It's the max overall for CM. So, first of all, you click, you gotta ha you gonna have to be a CDM position. You can be whatever height, whatever weight, it doesn't matter. You can distribute, like for example, I distribute my traits up on strength and stamina, as this is a CDM build that I use, but a different height. I play 5399, which is the smallest build. Uh, this is the same stats that I had used for my CDM build. I'll leave a link in the channel if you guys wanna check that out as well. So I'll highlight it for you guys in the description. Um, first of all, you have to be a CDM. You can be whichever height, whichever way, it does not matter. Uh, CDM, you then, once you register as a CDM, you guys can see it right here. It says CDM. You click on it and you go to profile. You you change your profile to right wing. It doesn't work with a, with a right mid, left mid, right, left wing. It does not work. It only works with a right wing. Now, click on that. And you guys, once it says right wing, you back out. It should say right wing on your profile. Now, you back out completely out of the thing. You go to your uh, my pro stats, your statistics, and you go to pro, uh, your player's profile. You click on that, and you can be uh, an athletic. You can switch your player to whatever body type you guys want to right here. Adjust it. You know, it's up to you guys. But I am an attack-minded player, so this build will help me, you know, improve my pace and improve my passes if I want to try this glitch. But I don't try it because I'm a striker in the, the day, not a CM. So first, you go to Athletic, you click right on the D-pad, you switch to Gameplay. Now you guys see right here, this is why I said it has to be a CDM. You have to be registered as a midfielder. Now when you switch it, you go to Role. You don't switch play style, preferred for... I know somebody in the description left a comment. I mean, in the comment, left a comment. Sec in the comment section, he left a comment. He was like, Haas, why don't you upload a video of a box-to-box -box CM? That's next week. Make sure you guys subscribe, turn on notification, and I will upload it next week. Now right here, you guys see it's registered as a right midfielder, which is right wing. But right wing, in common sense, it's an attack, uh, attacking for you know, attacking position. It's not a midfield position. That's how the game registers it. As right mid is a midfield position, but EA kind of messed up with this glitch. Again, it's EA. They always mess up. So you click right on the D-pad. You switch to attacking. Once you switch to attacking, you click options and you back out. Well, it's automatically backs you out. For Xbox, I believe it's uh, um, the same button combination. Now you guys see it says RAM. You have the stats of a RAM right here. 
But the main reason why I do it, it only works with a CDM. It doesn't work with a cam. You're basically playing in RAM, but with the stats of a cam. As you guys can see right here, you guys can take some of the stamina off if you guys want to. You can take some of this, you know, add it to this. Just, just adjust the build how you like. If you want to play RAM and cam, you can take these off. You can uh, add more dribbling to your player. You guys can do whatever you want to do. You know, but I say if you want to play cam with it, improve your finishing because cam's finishing can go up to, if you guys can see right here, I'm going to take this off and go right here. His finishing, the cam's finishing can go up to 89, which is insane. Uh, you don't have to get the power header, so maximum 86 for a cam, that's that's insanely good, you know. So, I'm going to leave it as is, I'm not going to adjust anything because the cam, if you're playing, if you want to play ram and cam, like you want your position to be ram, Try this glitch and uh, switch your player attributes as the traits from in the RAM position to the cam. Now, this is how you know it's a glitch. You go right here, and when I click on it, on position, it says goalkeeper. You know, you can be whichever height you want to be. You can be 6'7", 253, uh, 5'3", 99 pounds. The biggest and the smallest. It's up to you guys. Now, here you back out. We're not going to... It says RAM right here. You guys can see it. I have... Uh, the RAM is 89 rated with 3 skill points. I'm just going to get this, you know, for the defensive position. Or switch it to defense and get the interceptions. So, that's as in RAM. But, of course, you can play in RAM and switch it to an uh, attack-minded uh, traits. You guys should know what I'm talking about. Now, we back out right here. This is how you switch it to the defensive position. But when you switch to defensive, it's overall drops. Don't pay attention to the overall. It's just a number. That's player growth stats is the actual attributes that you have. Now, you click right here on player's profile. I'm explaining the glitch in detail, so you guys pay attention right here. So, you click on, right on the D-pad, you go back to gameplay, and you go from attacking to defensive, and you click option. You back out. Now, you're registered as an RDM, right defensive mid. Um, you guys can see his overall drops to 80, yet he has 95 pace, uh, 89 passing, 94 dribbling. You can play that in uh cam it's it's very fun trust me his passing and his dribbling and his pace it's insane so you guys can check his actual player's growth when you click on it you guys can, can go you can play right wing with this for with this build it doesn't matter now it's registered as a defensive position uh the name says defensive position but the build registers as a goalkeeper hence why it's 80 as you have no traits that involves defending and goalkeeping uh acceleration and you guys can see his finishing and his passing is insane. His curve, his dribbling, look at that. Like, those stats are insane. 96 agility, 86 balance, 95 ball control. And I don't even have all the ball control. So let's just take uh, the, sh the weak foot off and the finishing right here and go to dribbling and add these. Like, just see how overpowered your player is. 97 agility, 96 ball control, 86 balance, 95 uh dribbling like bro that's insane right here your stamina is insane so you can pretty much run uh run as a box to box play as a right wing and have enough stamina to play that position and you can just add them to and add more stamina to your player now this is for a defensive position where you should say rdm but you're registered as a right wing remember that so you have the stats of a right wing you can play that here is the best position about this glitch this position have yet to be in pro clubs in seven years i've been playing pro clubs for eight years now i have never seen this position i see it in the game but i don't see it on pro clubs the cm the the almighty cm position man it's been a while but they it's the the fifa doesn't want to add the cm for some reason but this is how you bring the cm build now you back out you switch it my bad you go to athletic and let me do it again real quick as you can see it's a cm you go right here, and you're registered as a, C as a goalkeeper again, but you go to Athletic, so you can pretty much, I will have a 91 overall, uh, max overall uh, glitch next week for a CM build, like, you're going to have Messi dribbling and fin Ronaldo finishing with, a, you know, a defensive attribute and strength, a lot of stamina and strength. Now, you go to Athletic, and you guys can see right here, you switch it from Click right on the D-pad, you go back to attack, and it should say defensive when you switch it. So it should say something like this. You get me? And then you just click uh, right on the D-pad until you say attacking, and you click option. Now, that's from the RDM. You switch from the RDM to the CM. Now, you guys can see right here, his register is a CM. 
Now, let's redo the glitch real quick so you guys uh, know what you guys are doing. A quick recap of the glitch. You switch to the CDM build. You can be whichever height you want to be. Again, this glitch has not been discovered by me. It's uh, by, discovered by World of JCC Trickster. So I'll leave a link in the channel description. So make sure you guys uh, uh, check that out. Show them some love. You guys do what you got to do. Now, CDM, let's do a quick recap of the glitch. Switch to CDM. And you go to Player's Profile. Right here. You go to Athletic. And you switch uh, to Gameplay. And you switch it to... Uh, you click... Ish. My bad. I forgot a part about the glitch. <laughs> uh, let me just back out real quick. Um, you got to switch it to the right wing. I forgot about that. So... It's still a CDM. You go to Player's Growth. You click on it. And you switch it to uh, right wing right here. And you guys can see right here. It's a right wing. You back out. It should say right wing. And then you go to Player's Profile. And you go to Athletic. Uh, athletic. Real quick. Right on the D-pad, gameplay. Click on roll, switch it to attacking. Now you're a ram. Again, I'm not going to go through the traits and all that. You guys can adjust that. You guys can see it's a ram. You click on the player profile again. You go to athletic. And you click on gameplay. And you click right on the D-pad on roll. And now he's a C RDM. Which registers as a CDM defensive position. But your position is still technically goalkeeper. You guys should know that. So... You click on this and it says RDM. Then you click on it one more time and that's how you get the CM position. You go to Athletic. You click right, right on the D-pad. You go to Roll. And you click uh, Attacking right on the D-pad again. Now when you click right on the D-pad again, you back out and you have a CM build. Mm, right here. Again, so this is the glitch. Uh, I don't know if you guys know it. You possibly know it by now. But if you don't know it, this is the glitch that's been going on in the community. But I have discovered a new glitch myself. And I'm going to upload it next week. So make sure you guys stay uh, tuned. Subscribe. Turn the notifications on. And again, this glitch, the position glitch, has not been discovered by me. It's discovered by World of GCC. I'll leave a link in the channel description, in the video's description. So make sure you guys check them out. Show them some love. You guys do what you got to do. And this has been your boy Haas. Thank you for subscribing, commenting, liking, sharing. You guys literally are the best. And again, this has been your boy Haas. And yeah, peace.